God the Father, creator of heaven and earth. O God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy upon us. O God the Holy Ghost, sanctifier of the faithful, have mercy upon us. O blessed, holy, and glorious Trinity, one God, have mercy upon us. Remember not, Lord Christ, our offenses, nor the offenses of our forefathers, neither reward us according to our sins. Spare us, good Lord, spare thy people, whom thou hast redeemed with thy most precious blood, and by thy mercy preserve us for ever. Spare us, good Lord. From all evil and wickedness, from sin, from the crafts and assaults of the devil, and from everlasting damnation, Good Lord, deliver us. From all blindness of heart, from pride, vainglory, and hypocrisy, from envy, hatred, and malice, and from all want of charity. Good Lord, deliver us. From all inordinate and sinful affections, and from all the deceits of the world, the flesh and the devil. Good Lord, deliver us. From all false doctrine, heresy, and schism, from hardness of heart and contempt of thy word and commandment. From lightning and tempest, from earthquake, fire and flood, from plague, pestilence and famine. Good from all oppression, conspiracy and rebellion, from violence, battle and murder, and from dying suddenly and unprepared. By the mystery of thy holy incarnation, by thy holy nativity and submission to the law, by thy baptism, fasting, and temptation, by thine agony and bloody sweat, by thy cross and passion, by thy precious death and burial, by thy glorious resurrection and ascension, and by the coming of the Holy Ghost. In all time of our tribulation, in all time of our prosperity, in the hour of death, and in the day of judgment, We sinners do beseech thee to hear us, O Lord God, and that it may please thee to rule and govern thy holy church universal in the right way. that it may please thee to illumine all bishops, priests, and deacons with true knowledge and understanding of thy word, and that both by their preaching and living they may set it forth and show it accordingly. We beseech thee to hear us, Lord That it may please thee to bless and keep all thy people,
that it may please thee to send forth laborers into thy harvest and to draw all mankind into thy kingdom. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to give to all people increase of grace to hear and receive thy word, and to bring forth the fruits of the Spirit. We beseech thee to hear us, That it may please thee to bring into the way of truth all such as have erred and are deceived. it may please thee to give us a heart to love and fear thee and diligently to live after thy commandments. That it may please thee so to rule the hearts of thy servants, the President of the United States, and all others in authority, that they may do justice and love mercy, and walk in the ways of truth. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord, that it may please thee to make wars to cease in all the world, to give to all nations unity, peace, and concord, and to bestow freedom upon all peoples. That it may please thee to show pity upon all prisoners and captives, the homeless and the hungry, and all who are desolate and oppressed. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to give and preserve to our use the bountiful fruits of the earth, so that in due time all may enjoy them. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to inspire us in our several callings, to do the work which thou givest us to do, with singleness of heart as thy servants, and for the common good. We beseech thee to us, good Lord. That it may please thee to preserve all who are in danger by reason of their labor or their travel. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to preserve and provide for all women in childbirth young women and young children and orphans, the widowed, and all whose homes are broken or torn by strife. We beseech thee to hear us, Lord. That it may please thee to visit the lonely, to strengthen all who suffer in mind, body, and spirit, and to comfort with thy presence those who are failing and infirm. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to support, help, and comfort all who are in danger, necessity, and tribulation. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to have mercy upon all mankind. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord. That it may please thee to give us true repentance, to forgive all our sins, negligences, and ignorances, and to endue us with the grace of thy Holy Spirit, to amend our lives according to thy word. That 
that it may please thee to forgive our enemies, persecutors, and slanderers, and to turn their hearts. We beseech thee to hear us, Lord. That it may please thee to show thy pity upon all prisoners and captives, that it may please thee to strengthen such as do stand, to comfort and help the weak-hearted, to raise up those who fall, and finally to beat down Satan under our feet. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord that it may please thee to grant to all the faithful departed eternal life and peace. We beseech thee to hear us, good Lord, that it may please thee to grant that in the fellowship of all thy saints we may attain to thy heavenly kingdom. We beseech thee to hear us, Son of God, we beseech thee to hear us. O Lamb of God, that takest away the sins of the world, O Lamb of God, that takest away the sins of the world, Takest away the sins of the world. O Christ, hear us. 